Stella, were you watching me? Were you watching me? Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Welcome to a brand new day. Every day holds the possibility of a miracle. All you need to do is get up and see what happens. That is really true. I, you might think I just say that, but it's so true. Anyway, today we have a lot of stuff happening. If you guys didn't notice, we've been fixing up the property because um, yeah, we want to put the horses out there. Well, this is what it looks like now. Remember before there was all that grass and gross and uh, Sam ran out of gas. So that's gonna happen hopefully today. And my lawnmower is over here. <laughs> we did all the grass down there in the arena. We got it all set up. Things are happening. Um, all this time, Ruby wanted to be best friends with Hendrix, and Hendrix was like, No, you are not my friend. But then now this is happening. It took this whole summer. <laughs> and now they're finally friends. Yay! <laughs> I love it when I hear the kick. You guys know what the kick means, right? <laughs> it means there's a nose there. Well, it's like, don't forget me. Oh, well, Gracie's getting braver. They might be making friends now. I suspect that these guys are gonna be great friends by the time we get back from our trip. Yeah, Gracie's already starting to lose weight. I don't want it to be too fast, but holy cow, like some horses just lose weight easily. She's not a complainer though, like she just never look unhappy. Literally, Gracie is such a happy horse, like I can't get over her. So when kids have been playing with her like crazy, and I've been watching her, watching her eyes, and I remember what Stella was like when Stella was not happy, and Gracie is not like that. She's just alert and active and happy, and she is only nine years old. She's nine years old. So we got her passport the other day. We found it, um, it's all online. And um, her old owner told us her name was Shopping for Shoes, but it's not, I love that name. Uh, her name is, oh, Best Kept Secret, that's it. <laughs> She's Best Kept Secret. So yeah, they did not know that they sold us like such a nice pony. So that was a Best Kept Secret. Don't tell them, don't tell them they shouldn't have sold her to us because she's amazing. She's gonna be the best little show pony for Brooklyn and Jacob. That, so today I wanted to tell you all the stuff that I know about Gracie before I forget because I keep forgetting. So another thing is that she's 12.2 hands high. A lot of you guys guessed that. We did measure her when we got her and we measured her at 12.2, but her passport confirmed that she is 12.2 hands high. So on her passport, it does not list what breed her mom is. We have no idea what her mom is, but I'm gonna guess what her mom was. So she has no mom, no, just joking. But anyway, her dad, are you guys ready for it? Are you ready for the breed of her dad? Or you guys might know that we've been like wondering what the heck breed is she? Cause she's got the dorsal, dorsal stripe and the zebra stripes. So there's some kind of done in there. Um, but she also looks like a Palomino. So what could she be? So I'm gonna tell you right now, her dad is a Palomino. Her dad is Palomino. So she's definitely Palomino. Um, but because of the stripes, and um, the brown in her fur, like in her mane and stuff, like the bay in there. I'm gonna guess that her mom was a dun. That's, that's all I can guess. I'm guessing that her mom was a dun or had done in her to give her a dun gene. Oh no, that's not yours. That is not yours. No, don't bite me. Oh my God, you're powerful. Willow, you got more green. Oh my goodness. Willow. Finish your grain, Missy. Otherwise, Gracie will eat it. Oh, you don't want it? Whoa, what is that about? Whoa! Maybe she just couldn't see it. Sometimes that happens. Good girl. Such a good girl. I noticed a change in the horses today, you guys. I noticed a big change. Well, uh, they're closer together and Gracie's not looking at us like to be her savior anymore as much I think that her and Willow are starting to bond. Are you starting to be nice to her a little? Are you? And Willow's old field. She was the boss She was the boss. I think she said that she was the boss so 
Doesn't surprise me that she's bossing Gracie around. Anyway, that is all I know about um, Gracie. 12.2, her dad is a Palomino. Um, her actual show name is Best Kept Secret. So this stall will get fixed up when uh, we get home. And yeah, we probably will do it ourselves. Believe it or not, Sam is pretty accomplished when it comes to building stuff. Just not fences. But our fence did work excellent yesterday. The storm did not take off, did not get away. Um, anyway, today is a busy day and I'm gonna tell you why. So you guys know that um, we're going on our trip on Friday. We leave Friday morning and I wanted it, it to be like the best trip. I, I don't wanna like be worried about stuff. So. Um, today the farrier is going to come and trim all of our horses uh, uh, feet. They're going to all get new shoes, just the ones that wear shoes. Um, we're going to have the farrier today. Tomorrow on Wednesday the chiropractor is coming and all three of our big horses are all getting an adjustment. All three of them are going to get all fixed up so that they're in fine tuned shape for our trip. Right Storm, you wanna be fine tuned? Storm and Finn get adjusted every single month because we ride them all the time. Stella has only had a few adjustments since we've had her, um, maybe four. Uh, and it's been a couple of months since she's had one, so she's gonna get hers done. And so yeah, we're doing a lot of preparation for our trip so that everything, and like you know, the best laid plans don't always work out, but we're doing our best. Also, in trailer news, Sam, tell them what's happening with the trailer. Are we gonna have it in time? I don't know yet. I have to take it to the mechanic now to get it tested and rewired. Are you kidding? I was like excited. I thought you meant that it was ready. It's welded. All right, so all the work is done. Now we just need to get it rewired. Retested first. Oh God, how did they test it? Mm. Tested to make sure mm. it will uh, hold? hold. Oh my gosh. I was excited for a minute, now I'm worried. Today is Tuesday. This is the first that I'm thinking that we might not have a trailer, but we'll have a trailer, I just know it. But anyway, let's get on with the video. We're gonna take our horses out for breakfast, for grass. So every day we mix things up a bit, like, Storm spends time in the morning with Finn because Storm keeps Finn behaving. If Storm doesn't, if Finn doesn't spend time with Storm, then he treats Stella worse. Like we're using all of our her dynamics in our best interest. That's Stella down here with the boys. It's electrified. So that's there. Okay, so how am I getting out if it's electrified? It's not electrified right now, it's on. Oh, okay. I'm always talking about how like amazing it is um, to take care of horses because, because it's so relaxing for us. But I, I was just thinking about how the fact that we actually have time to take care of them. Like we very rarely have stress. We don't have to be anywhere. Like however long it takes us to take care of them is how long it takes us to take care of them. So that's why one of the reasons it's so stress free. But also when school starts next week, it'll be different again because we will have school. But then again, because we have homeschool, it still won't be as bad. But yeah, Sam. Ooh, we could make this bigger now. That's what the girls want, but. Girls want it bigger? Yeah, it'll be good for. Hill, yeah, that's okay. Going uphill and downhill is so good for them. Like, this is a nice, gentle hill. But yeah, Sam's been cutting, I've been cutting. This should be gone in another year or so. That's me being sarcastic. Sometimes I feel like it seems like we just live down at the barn because that's all I video, but we are home. We have been doing chores, trying to get cleaned up. Yeah, and now we're going back down to the barn though. Macy, say hi. Say hi to them. They haven't seen you in so long. Macy! Say Macy hi. Macy up. Macy up. Macy. She's looking at the couch now. Yeah, somebody spilled egg there. Hmm. I don't eat eggs. It was you. It was me. And there's Cookie oh, there over goes. there. Cookie! Here, lick my hand. Okay, anyway. She loves to lick our dogs literally climb on you and lick you yeah. even if you're a stranger they're not guard chihuahuas except for ruby is a guard dog and a babysitter but our little chihuahuas just run to you and lick you i like to make sure the horses have a good breakfast before we do anything with them all right you guys 
It's back. Uh oh, sorry. I actually need to go in there and see what stuff I need. I need to clean this out. I need to clean it out. down to the barn and what happened Sophia? Ruby pushed me. Ruby ran right into her, knocked her down onto her knees. Okay, let's see that. Last night I was uh, thinking about how I really want to ride Stella Bitless. I want, we need to oil our stuff better because they're getting like hard. This, this is dusty. I want to oil all of our stuff we're before we go. so dusty. Yeah. Anyway, so Sophie's going to give me her Bitless bridle. <laughs> She's like, really? Uh, because it doesn't fit Finn, right? What about if we poked holes? Would it fit him? When riding with these knees. Would it? Would it? <laughs> but bad luck, Ruby. You're such a mean girl. You run into people. You're not a horse. Um, uh, would this fit Finn if we but put I, more I, holes? I'm glad that it didn't. Would have this fit Finn? I don't think so. But we also, you already have one for Finn, don't you? Like all the way up here. Okay, so this is going to be for Stella. Do you have one for Finn? She does have a bitless bridle for Finn. That red one. Let's see it. With these reins. Yeah, she's got red reins. Do you want to bring it with us? To where? Camping? No. Like, we're going to pack up a lot of stuff. So, wait, let me see it again. So, she has this kind of bitless bridle. I do not know what it's called. This one is called a side um, pull. Our coach used to have this. Don't want to say her name. Or am I allowed to say right? Yeah. So Fiona used to have this, but blue. Yeah. And I got this from her. Did we get that from Fiona? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. No, I don't think so. I think we bought it at a yard sale. No, we bought this. We got this one at a greenhouse the closing sale. Oh yeah. Okay. And so anyway, it's amazing. We have everything we need. Like. But this this one is kind of annoying because of this. It goes in like that. It's just like yeah, I like it though. It's a nice. I don't know. This and is the rope actually. Is like our trainer only lets us use certain kinds of bitless bridles. Some of them are dangerous. Those are the only kind of shoes she lets us use. Things. So um, basically the farrier is going to be here soon. So we need to. Um, I'm supposed to hand walk Stella today. Hand walk her. I should get her halter. You guys. She was coming to me, and then I stopped to take the camera out so you guys could see, and she stopped. You guys can eat grass, you know. There's lots of grass back there for you. Why don't you go eat the grass? Now she's going to run away from me. Don't you run away from me, Missy. You want to go for a walk? Do you? Let's go get a brush. like so excited and she starts to speed up and she starts to I swear she might be feeling good like if I was on her right now I feel like she would have just trotted off with me because she's so excited other than the whole grass thing Stella Sophie said the same thing she's like oh my gosh she is so excited and she just wants to go I don't know you guys what do you think <laughs> she also just wants to eat the grass as does Willow. Willow, come on. Oh, look at her. Does she look okay? She's sassy right now. Yeah, she's sassy. Sassy's okay though. Yeah. She she needs lunch. <laughs> Sophie's doomed to go on the ground. Gabby and I went down to the last seal to get the boys out. I put Finn, I interchange him back and forth. Storm seems to do better on his own, but I like, yeah, never again. Like, never again. We went down to get them and Storm was just, had the run on Finn so bad. Like, I, we, they were just galloping and galloping. Finn, terrified. Storm is an idiot sometimes. And I know they're just like horses, blah, blah, blah. 
but there's no need for this. None. I mean, mostly it's just fur gone and the top layer of skin, but that is just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Looks like you got them here and here too. Well, you got a few days to heal up. You're not going back with him. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Like, horses are different. Look, my hair is just getting worse throughout the day, but horses are so different. Like, some horses are, like, puppies. And some, like, Storm is such an aggressive horse. Like, uh, in the field. Everybody's napping. Two ponies for two little girls. We should have always had two ponies, huh? Need to hold her back. All right, here it is happening. Fitty Finn is about to have a little ride with his new boots. This is my dream, you guys. I'm about to go sit on those chairs with my dirty old mare behind me. She rolled. And watch Gabby ride. He's on you. <laughs> He's sassy now. Look at him lifting up the front. <laughs> he looks like a dressage pony. Oh my gosh, Shelby, those boots may have slowed him down. He's bouncy at those shoes. He's got springs on his feet. So he's with Gracie and she's waiting for her turn. She wants to ride Finn. He knows the word canter. Wait till he calms down. Going down the wrong lead just until he comes down. Uh oh, he doesn't like the boots. Could be because of the noise. He does get like concerned when there's a lot of. You like the sound of the boots? I like him in the boots, you guys. I think he goes good in the boots. Sophie's confidence has been building like crazy lately. Ever since she had that really good ride on Finn where he was framing for her, it built confidence in her. Anyway, she's been building like so much love for him and we found the button for making him slow down. Shoes, he doesn't love them. He doesn't love them so he goes slow. You're gonna ride Finny bareback? He'd probably love it. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.